All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, if you don't know, I am a T5 complete paraplegic. So I got this stomach, can't sit up straight, paralyzed from the chest down. And I'm gonna show you how I get in a pool. This one doesn't have a ladder, doesn't have a ramp, it doesn't even have the handles that I would grab and throw myself in. So I'm just gonna get close and throw myself in it. I am not medicated. My legs are pretty spastic right now, so let me let them shake out before they throw me off when I'm getting in the water. All right, good enough for now. All right, let's see how I'm gonna manage this. forward so I don't want that leverage. Ooh. Come on. Throwing my balance off. I'm about to just roll in. Yeah? <laughs> you know what? I feel like with the wheelchair? You stupid? Come on. Okay. All right, it's really hard to fight the spasms, so. Just wait for it to stop, and then I'm just gonna push off of this right wheel. End up in the water, hopefully. All right, guys, here we go. Woo! Way different than I thought. I'm pretty sure that's my first time getting in the water like that if you have you know the little gate rods that stick out by the uh ladders on most pools use those and those are also going to help you get in and then also guys just real quick your dead legs will float that easy and then uh I will get to getting out maybe in another video or in this one. I don't know, but if I don't like the video for what I just did, I don't recommend trying it unless you have someone to help you or someone to assist you if you mess up. All right, guys, and I just wanted to add, as you noticed, I got in the deep end so that, you know, you don't hit the bottom, you don't scratch your toes. But if you're in the shallow end like now, the bottom's right there. I just touched it. I would go backwards so that the bottom of your feet, if anything, are touching the bottom of the pool and not the tops of your toes, because I've come out of a pool with bloody tops of my toes scratched. And most of the time, I recommend just staying in the deep end, like over here on this side. And then you see in the deep end where I jumped in, there's my chair still right there. Your legs can just float and dangle. So. That's what I recommend, deep water only. And, you know, of course, lay on your back, let your legs float and do the backstroke is the fastest way swimming backwards for me. But all right, guys, on to the next one.